wee bit of clock in the morning and it's departure day so it's taken oh, three months of pretty much juggling three lives trying to get everything organized to even get to this point for the departure today to head off and to be honest I'm a little bit nervous and uh, a little bit apprehensive of a fair bit going on but excited too so yeah forecast is not too bad 15 to 20 so we'll have that up the bum so it should be a nice easy ride uh, I'm gonna leave Early Beach and go to Gloucester Island for tonight and maybe the next day head up to Cape Upstate we'll see as we go along anyway watch the episodes so yeah good morning it starts everything starts somewhere it's got to start here today Baby. We did a series of videos, 10 videos, when we delivered the boat from Sydney to Ealing Beach. And that was like three years ago. And every now and then, my, when I go to YouTube, it pops up in my feed. And I go, oh, yeah. And I watch it again. It's like, it's like having your home movies play every now and then. Yeah, yeah. So even if no one looks at our YouTube channel, I don't care. This is, <laughs> this is for something that, all the way to Thailand, I'll have 100 episodes. And my whole life, just bring in a bit more. The whole life is going to keep popping up in my feet. I need to see it over and over. Yeah, yeah. So we're just going to stay on the starboard side of the channel here, mate. So we're just going to basically going to follow this rock wall at this distance. Okay. Um, we need to make room for boats coming in. To the other side. Okay. 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 So we just left uh, Able Point, uh, it's not Able Point Marina, it's Coral Sea Marina now. And uh, we just got the motor running for a short while while we do some lessons on lines and stuff, get used to our, our uh, time on the boat. And very shortly we're going to set some sails and run downwind.
start meeting or reaching across the uh, back of the island, there's going to be some big gusts. So we're going to reef uh, the mainsail shortly and reduce its size uh, so that we don't get overpressed. But we're just going to go a little bit further around here before we do that. So we're here in uh, Sandy Bay, Gloucester Island, at the southern end of Gloucester Island, uh, near Gloucester Passage. And it's a beautiful little spot. There's five other boats in here at the moment. I've got three uh, little monohull yachts anchored in front of me, a little uh, monohull powerboat, and to the left an old, a little sailing cat. Now, as we're anchored a little bit further out than them, I think we might be slightly bigger. Uh, but anyway, they've got the best spots, but it's all good. Uh, we had one massive bullet hit us at the top end of Gloucester Island there in Squally Bay, very aptly named. Um, so that laid us right in our ear and brought a little water uh, along the deck. Probably the most water I've ever had uh, up the side of the deck of the boat. Um, yeah, pretty exciting. I reckon, hard to tell, but kind of busy at the time. But uh, from other gusts were around that 26 to 30 knots. I reckon that one was well in excess of 40. Um, and, you know, I had too much sail up, so live and learn. So we'll stay here tonight and then maybe tomorrow head off. It just depends on what uh, the forecast is. It's still talking 25 knots um, for tomorrow. So the green crew and everything, I think we might just hold off. We'll just wait and see what it does. Uh, they've done really, really well today. We've seen whales, um, and you'll see that whale uh, photos there, uh, video. And what else did we do? Oh, and we caught ourselves a Spanish mackerel, so that's dinner tonight. So in the meantime, we're just going to chill in Sandy Bay, Wasser's Island. Made no sense to move on, although we could sail downwind in 25 knots. Um, it'd be in a fairly lumpy kind of sea once we got halfway between here and uh, uh, Cape Upstart. But, uh, and my crew's fairly new, you know, they're, they're not really, uh, I wouldn't say they had their sea legs yet, so better to wait the two days out here until that uh, 25 knots settles back down to 15 to 20 and then we'll set some sail and head up to um, Cape Upstart. But, you know, like, there's worse places you could be stuck. This is gorgeous. There's mountains. Right. Just literally coming straight up to the beach. All nice and green because of all the rain that we've had in North Queensland recently. Big sandy beach. Um, I'm sure there's fish here if we put an effort in to try and catch something. We're not alone. There's uh, one, two, three, four, five, six other boats here with us at the moment. It's not a big anchorage, but there's plenty of room here for, you know, probably at least double that number of boats. Um, yeah, so I could think of worse places to stay.